Hello everyone, I'm Tanya Paul and today we are going to talk about high heels and I'm going to show you some of my favorites. Here we go! Let's start with the first pair, Christian Louboutin. Here I got two Kate 120 patent black. Let's see what we have inside the box. A dust bag, spare parts for the heels and of course the heels. Let's have a closer look. This particular model has a shiny look and a stiletto 12 cm heel. This is a Christian Louboutin suitcase. They are 100% handmade in Italy and they come in many different colors. There is also a 10 cm model and they are named after English model Kate Moss. Louboutin suitcase. They have the highest heels in Monday shoes I'm talking about today. The room for the toes is very tiny and there is not enough space, especially for me, that I have such long toes. That's why I had to pick 40 and a half instead of my usual 40. The footbed is very steep, so when wearing that, you are basically not walking but tiptoeing. Considering that and the fact that the leather is very steep, the overall feeling when wearing them is a big discomfort. Let's see how they look with a pair of nylons on. Now let's have a look at the second pair I got here for you. They're Jimmy Choo Romy 100 Patent Leather Red. Let's see what I got here. Dust bag and of course shoes. This particular model has a shiny look and a 10 cm heel. They come in many different colors, fabrics and heights. I personally love this red one. They are also one of their best-selling pumps and they are world famous as many celebrities wear them. These are the Jimmy Chiromi Reds. I'm wearing them without stockings. The design is very simple, they're true to size. I'm wearing now a European number 40 or 9 American size. Considering the shoe type and the heel height, I can say that they are pretty comfortable and they are suitable for an everyday use. Here we go! Let's move on to our third pair, Yves Saint Laurent OQ 110. And let's see what I got inside the box. A lot of paper and finally the shoes. This model is black and the iconic heel is called Triple Gold Officier. Let's have a closer look at my Yves Saint Laurent. I have to say they're one of my favorite pumps. They're handmade in Italy. They're super soft as you can see. And despite the iconic heel, they're quite steady and easy to walk in. Here I got one of my favorite pumps, Yves Saint Laurent Opu. They are one of the first designer shoes that I bought. I find them very unique with this iconic YSL heel of 11 cm. Overall, the design is very simple and they are true to size. I'm wearing a European number 49 US. The leather is smooth and they feel nice on my feet. Despite of the unusual heel form, I find them very stable. I'm in love with them. And now with nylons. These are the Valentino Garavani rock soft pumps. They come in many different colors, fabrics and heights. I personally love them because they're very versatile. You can wear them as an elegant shoe and you can also wear them on informal occasions. And they're also very comfortable. This model has black metal details and an ankle strap. Now wearing the Valentino rock stud. They have this ankle strap embellished with black metal studs. All the materials are high quality and I love how they feel on my feet. They look amazing and sexy and they're perfect for any occasion. I really enjoy wearing them. And now with a pair of black pantyhose. First thing to consider is their price. Another aspect to take into consideration is the comfort. I personally wouldn't recommend the suitcase. They're pretty uncomfortable and I can walk over them for a long time. Oops, my bad. 
Talking about these three guys here regarding comfort, I would personally go with the Valentino ones because they're the lightest and it's pretty easy to walk in them. Last but not least is the look. As I stated before, they all look gorgeous to me. But at this point, the only thing that matters is your personal taste. The thing is, even if they're a little bit discomfortable or pricey, if you're gonna fall in love with them, it doesn't matter what I'm gonna tell you, I'm not gonna change your mind. So let me know in the comments which one did you like the most and which one would you like to get for yourself. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and check my other social media where you can see more of my looks. I'll drop the links below. Bye!